Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to today's quick video. Today, Apple has released iOS 12.4 to the public. This marks the fourth major update to iOS 12, and it could be one of the last. Now, there's a couple things right here in this description as to new features and things like that, but we will know more as time goes on. Anyway, definitely check out our written article pertaining to iOS 12.4 for more minute by minute updates as we discover new features in the OS. We mainly wanted to make this video to let everyone know that iOS 12.4 has been released, but more details will be on our website. Anyway, let's get directly into things. Now, right from this update right here, you can get a gist of what iOS 12.4 is going to comprise of. It says iOS 12.4 introduces iPhone migration to directly transfer data from an old iPhone to a new iPhone. There's also some enhancements to Apple News Plus and improves the security and updates and things like that. So that's a gist as to what iOS 12.4 is going to add. One thing that's missing here is any mention about the Apple card. Now, Apple said that that is going to be coming out late July, so I'm surprised that that hasn't been released today to coincide with this update. Now, in the background, there still might be some fundamental code being implemented in iOS 12.4 that allows the Apple card to function properly. Anyway, we'll have to wait on more updates on that. Today, I just wanted to get this video out to let you know that iOS 12.4 has been released. You can easily update to it directly within the settings app under general and software update. But again, if you guys are interested in jailbreaking, definitely do not update to this firmware. Stay on the lowest version of iOS 12 that you can. Because even though iOS 12.4 is out and iOS 13 is right around the corner from being released later this fall, there still could be new exploits for older iOS versions like iOS 12.3. Now we just saw that happen with the iOS 12.2 jailbreak. If you guys don't know, there is a brand new jailbreak out for iOS 12.2. The main kernel exploit that was released that made that possible was actually patched in iOS 12.3. So we could see another round of jailbreaks come out for iOS 12 before iOS 13 is released. If the case is the same where the kernel exploit was patched in this iOS 12.4 update, the developer that found that vulnerability might actually release his research if it pertains to iOS 12.3 and 12.3.1 but is already patched by Apple in this brand new update. Anyway guys, like I said, stay on the lowest possible version of iOS 12 that you can. There's a new iOS 12.4 update today that has officially come out. This could be the very last update we see to iOS 12 before iOS 13 is out of beta stages. Anyways, we're gonna be doing a follow-up video with this new iPhone mitigation feature, so definitely like, comment, and subscribe before you head out. Thank you so much for watching this video. Again, stay tuned. We're gonna have an awesome follow-up and some more awesome content this week. But until next time, guys, this is Tony signing out.